السلام عليكم in this video I will teach you how to make a curtain wall with hexagon pattern uh, and actually you can create different patterns but I will uh, show you an example on the hexagon first you need to create a mass because here usually you, you don't have uh, this option if you create a curtain wall so we will create a new mass in place mass okay you can show the let's go to the 3d view for example and show the reference plane and uh, let's draw a spline for example okay escape select the line and click create form now select this surface tab to find it and select it uh, and click on divide surface after you divided the surface you can go to properties and uh, select different patterns as you can see you have multiple patterns you can select uh, one of them I will select the hexagon of course it looks ugly so you need to play with the number of segments maybe this one should be 20 yes or maybe 25 much better okay and we can select uh, how we want it to look like like partial or overhanging let's make it overhanging okay and now you have the uh, divided surface you need to place uh, panels on your divided surface to have this uh, curtain wall with a hexagon pattern uh, so you need to create this pattern this uh, panel you go to the main menu open then go to family now you find the curtain panel by pattern go to this file and find the hexagon uh, surface of course we can just uh, load this load this panel but uh, it's better to give it like a mullion so we want to create the mullion first place a reference point on this uh, line okay uh, tab to select the point and set uh, sorry yeah we want to set the plane here uh, you can either draw a, a circle or a different shape for the mullion okay 120 by oh, 100 by 100 and i want to draw a reference so, okay. just to know how to move it and move from here to here Okay, we don't need these reference lines anymore. And select this and the path as well by clicking Control. Uh, then click on Create Form. And as you can see, the mullion will be created uh, around this panel. Select this mullion and go to Properties you'll find material by category you can uh, add parameters because usually it, it doesn't appear let's try to keep it just select material and ok uh, and then go to load into project ok we want a second project let's go to the 3d mm -hmm. click on the surface and we will go to this menu and under this menu we will find uh, our uh, our hexagon or the panel but there is something okay let's try it first placed okay let's make it realistic now we have mullions as well as uh, glazed hexagon uh, panels but there's something that I did wrong or it's not wrong but it's better to do it and I forgot to do it 
uh, when when I was working on let's go to this panel where was it yeah this one because this is a default file we, it's better not to work on it any I mean you have to uh, save it with a new name like you can give it a name like with a million for example and save it so to keep the original one as is and then you can load it and uh, place it on your project okay. and this is our wall thank you for watching and i hope it was useful for you